Hey guys, welcome. Who's that guy or girl? Woman? Do you have a Zoom? That's okay, the zoom. woman. That's that... the one. Oh, the nurse. Yeah. Okay. It was either that or it was Cat. Nah. Uh, but anyway, hey guys, welcome back to some more Call of Cthulhu uh, for Cult Tober. We are doing. Whose house is this? This is um. This is the Ghoulie Mansion. Yeah. It's, it's just because the they... weren't there boards over those windows. No. No. I don't think Wait, so. Can I go? Can I go through? No. I want to know what Bradley and Dr. Colden have to say about all this. I don't want to leave yet. You're awake, Mr. Pierce. How do you feel? Like shit. Did I sleep long? The day is only starting. It's fine. I didn't answer my question, bitch. How, how many hours was I out? A month? He has, a, like, a full beard. <laughs> He's like, no, nah, you was you wasn't asleep for long. How's our fugitive? Doctor Fuller hasn't reported your disappearance to the force, but that'll come soon. Bradley, who else would it be? Mr. But Pierce. Why would I be a fugitive if I ran away from the hospital? There are things I can't explain. Uh, yeah, like him being evil. Uh, I might be onto a lead. Dr. Bradley. Oh. You don't have a uh, occultism professional. Uh so talk to Colden or talk to Bradley. Um but they had me endure. I, I met a Francis Sanders. I talked to her. I oh, you're just gonna block us? <laughs> I haven't seen him you gonna sit down or to the basement. how does I do human? Sarah Hawkins, and that's what killed him. Yep. How did he die? Uh, sure. He knew Sarah Hawkins. I just told you that's what killed him. <laughs> it was the knowledge of her name and face. He called it a sort of crisis, or he called him the Shambler. I didn't see what, but something was there with us. Of what do you speak? Sanders said. Sarah Hawkins, a visitor. He spoke of it like a living being. Sarah Hawkins? Have I missed something here? Yes. By the way, thanks for committing me, by the way. <laughs> you really think she's involved? How could she have murdered Mr. Sanders? I didn't say that. mentioned Mrs. Hawkins just before dying. It's no coincidence. Uh-huh. You know, Francis Sanders was a well-known art collector. Uh huh. I guess you can still pay a visit to his wife, Irene Sanders. Uh huh. An art collector, you say? That's Wait, am I done talking? I mean, you Plan chose the option that ended the conversation. Please spare the widow the instead of, her late husband's you know. suffering. Okay, I don't know what those icons are. I'm going to be honest. The I don't know what those icons are. The brackets are ones that give you additional options and allow you to gather additional information. Let's stay prudent. Better to confront the truth. Uh. He's right. We can't ignore the truth. But it could drive her mad. Oh. Better madness than this will affect your Very destiny. Well. I'll go to see we have to we have to face the truth. I'll find a link between her husband's death and Sarah Hawkins. Don't end up in the hospital this time. <laughs> I'll do my best. Yeah, that way is uh, I, I don't want to have to tell them that you're a psycho again. The other night's events are still confused in my head. Yeah, me too. Also, you, you died. died. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking died. Another, All right, no, nope. no more books, no more nothing. I don't think so. All right, fine. Yeah, well, you know, Wait, what? you have to hold it down. There you oh, go. what's down here? Well, there's a Sanders residence. 
Or at least that's where you're heading to. I don't know if that image is actually connected to where I'm heading. I mean, it probably is, considering he said that Sanders was an art collector, and this all looks like art. Yeah, but I've been through this through this way, right? Haven't I? Yes, but you're exiting the building. Right. But I don't remember this room. Because it's not in this room, in this building. It's in Sanders. Okay, so... Not Hawkins. Right, okay, Sanders. so this has nothing to, nothing to do with... Hawkins. No, it Okay, doesn't. I just skipped you, straight sir? to her. Mrs. Yes. Sanders? Okay. I'm a private detective. Why does he always sound out of breath during Why certain so? periods? I don't know. It's a great question. I come in. You may. Because no one else does. No. Even people dying. <laughs> before we go any further, please know that my husband died yesterday. That is precisely what brings me here. Oh, you're a lesbian now. Look who's here. Hi. You leaving or? We, we, okay. What's going on? We, know each other. we met briefly. Are they sisters? Time enough to iron out a few matters. They don't look like sisters. The main thing is that we understand. Shine down my balls. The brave detective <laughs> has a talent for sticking his nose into my business. Uh-huh. Her pussy. Her every time I'm Sorry. <laughs> it's a small island, detective. My island. Uh-huh. Sure it is. Bumping into me. Nah. I'm investigating Francis' death. Why? Uh, I'm an investigator. Um, I spoke to Francis before he died. His story suggests a link to a case I'm working on. Well, since this business has got nothing to do with me, I'll be in your husband's office, Irene. We'll carry on. Why? Very well, Miss Baker. Can I kill her? This way, Mr. Pierce. <laughs> Can I please kill her? I don't feel like she's an ally. Hey, she is. She's one of those annoying allies. A lot of paintings of you. Huh. Huh. So has got a bit of an ego. May I inquire? No, he. When he was the painter. No, right? he was not. He was a collector. Yes. Sir. Oh. I met him at the hospital. That's even weirder. Yeah. He spoke to me about Sarah Hawkins. Did he get that from your last affair? He spoke to you about her. That's all he talked about. Sarah Hawkins and her paintings. You are way too reclined back in that chair. The fact is that I have not been allowed to see him since he was interned. You, on the other hand, a uh -huh. stranger, were able to see him and even talk with him the day he died. Yeah. How was he? Oh, he was an amazing lover. This attack. What happened? Uh huh. Uh oh. You must not feel guilty. Uh, he died screaming right before my eyes. Jeez, I was no longer no. there when it happened. Uh, you're uh, taking it quite well. I mean, professional psychology, so, what you know. What happened to your husband is terrible, Mrs. Sanders. But from what I saw... Don't put your chin in your chest. <laughs> the man I met yesterday had lost his reason. He suffers no longer, if you would allow me such a platitude. Of course. Okay. Thank you for your kind words. Yeah. Nobody in that hospital would have deigned to speak them to me. However, uh, it will require okay. more than that to soothe my mind. Oh, I'm just not I... having sex with you. <laughs> How could this happen? Not that you're not my type. In Listen, I just... Uh, people have been trying to kill me <laughs> ever since I got here. Did you not do I, my I'm balls not still mood. hurt from when she put a knee in them. Uh, I share your grief, but I had nothing to do with it. Test your eloquence, or uh, the true uh, culprit is Fuller, or it wasn't me who sent him there. Ooh, I mean, it wasn't me who sent him there. It's kind of mean because it's like, bitch, you yeah. did this. Um, yeah. So, Mrs. Sanders, I understand. Uh, sounds like it didn't work. That's what it sounds like. But I had nothing to do with the death of your husband. I've just arrived on Dark Water. I'm investigating the death of the Hawkins family. The death of the Hawkins family? Yeah, you did know they died, right? It's not an accident. They still died. Death is still could still be an accident. <laughs> it's a murder. Flee it like the plague. Oh, I'm tired, Mr. Pierce. I would be grateful if you could tell me what you expect of me, and then leave. Oh God. Uh, did he speak to you of a shambler? Uh, how do you know Sarah Hawkins? Uh, what is Cat doing here? I mean, I really want to know what Cat's doing here, but let's I mean, find out about the Shambler. 
Azure. Did your husband talk to you about Sarah Hawkins' visitor? A shambler, to use his precise terms. <laughs> well, you can't imagine that's all he talked about. It's exhibited at the center of the gallery. Nobody Does he have an affair? Endowed him with the privilege. Really sounds like he was having an affair. A miserable end to his mm. life. Hold on. The Shambler is a painting by Sarah Hawkins. Not a painting. Who else could paint such horrors? Oh, I was hoping it was Take a statue. That'd be nice. So yeah. okay. It is my only lead at this stage. I suppose I have nothing to lose. Then you have paid no heed. For my part, I refuse to set foot in that gallery again. That's fine. If you are so eager to see it. Huh? I, I mean, I wouldn't say eager. I mean, I sure. Of that thing as soon as I can. All right. Thank you, Mrs. Sanders. I won't be long. Are you, is she selling the paintings? Is that why Cat is here? Oh, maybe. That would be interesting. The day the Shambler came into the Sanders' lives. Whoa. That's a big That's painting. A big painting. Wait. Oh, okay, That's okay. Sarah. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Oh. I can just investigate this place. Okay. Did she really care for him, after all? In all receipt of the letter in which you demand Ooh. the body of your deceased husband, I am sorry to inform you that I cannot agree to return his body to you. At the moment oh, of his Lord. internment, you signed a discharge, allowing me to dispose of his body as I see fit. I expected... Or extended, I extend my deepest condolences to you, Thomas Fuller. Yeah, he didn't give a reason why he's not. He just said, uh, you no. said that I, I, I get to, so I will. That is beautiful, but it means nothing. Uh, you want to do a reconstruction? Or he's, okay. I do. I just want to gather a little okay, bit. Okay, more medical knowledge. Hell yeah. Uh, if you don't mind, I'm going to just take this book for it. Yep, thank you. She wasn't looking. Oh, cool. I can hide in here. Why would I need to do that? <sighs> I'm going to pretend like you're not here. Is that fine? <laughs> T. Oh, I'm going to find out about Cat. Francis Sanders and Sarah Hawkins no. were close. Friends, even? Wait! This happened recently? What? What are you talking about? Like, did they recently sit down and have tea and she just left those tea, the tea there? Nah. How can I get? Those teacups aren't there. I know, but I mean, like, what information, what, what am I gathering from this? A house of artists. A house of artists. Okay. A house of artists. Is that it? A house of artists. It's not part of the reconstruction, I guess. A house of artists. A house, house of, of artists. artists. House of artists. Oh, is this like a Sanders accession register? He wrote beside the Shambler. Finally. Oh, okay. Did Sarah Hawkins fear so much that she didn't want to sell a painting. Is she uh, painting for she's like dream painting? I mean maybe. Huh. House of artists. <laughs> <laughs> House of Artists. Artists. A house of artists. A house of artists. <laughs> can can you go in here? No, there's an invisible barrier. Oh. That thing, maybe? It's really... Finally won. Was Sanders aware of his imminent doom? I mean... She hated it. He loved it. Okay. I haven't really gotten a good look at it other than the... Little photo, so obviously I wouldn't have. She despises Sarah Hawkins, but it's the painting she truly hates. Why? Uh, because it terrifies her. She made her. it, and because of his obsession with it. First, refused to sell the painting. How did that make her feel? Uh, like she wanted to refuse selling the painting. Like she didn't want to do it, begrudgingly. Uh, okay. Ah! What? Why would I? Well, how would I gather that information? What was in here to give me that? Sure, I could have seen the ledger. Uh. Whoa. That is something wrong with that. That is picture. some creepy ass. But I mean, like the tea's not here. Like the painting's not here. Yeah. Like it's just vague clues from conversation. Let's see what this cylinder has to say once it's inserted in the. <laughs> 
There he is. There's HP Lovecraft. Nice. Golden. Gold molded record. Oh, it's a phonograph. Yeah. It's not, um, it's not, a, you know, yeah, it's not a record. It's a. It's a record. It's basically a record. It's just not a flat disc record like we're used to. Uh huh. Close the door. <laughs> a strange Amerindian pendant. Okay. Uh, Amerindian? Nice. Occultism increased. Whale in the cod. What is this going to increase? Uh, no. I don't think I did anything. I don't think, yeah. I could use one of those. This is more sleeping pills. Oh, yeah, baby. Am I, do I have a clay, do I actually right. use those? You will eventually. For months, Sarah Hawkins refused to part with her painting to finally give it away for nothing. I beg you to give oh, up all hope of ever owning this ac uh, accursed painting. If our friendship has any meaning for you, please spare me the weight of guilt. Uh, I cannot be the architect of your fall. I beg you, my dear friend, forget the shambler. Your friend, Sarah Hawkins. Interesting. Weird. Yeah. Not gonna go to the thing on. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. I want to check around the desk first. Another volume of the Reverend's wife's diary. Diary of the pastor's wife. Some members of the community, her husband included, began to speak of their vision as a messenger sent by God. She is scared. I mean, would that be a message sent by God? They will suffer the same fate <laughs> as the lost tribe. Well, all right. All right, it then. That's just uh, strength. Oh, oh, you got it. Hell yeah. He to the Sanders Gallery. Well, oh. Uh, Desertion on an anatomical question? I think it's a Oh, question. dissertation. No, medical. Oh, okay. More medical. Really? Hell yeah. All right, let's talk to this. Oh, All right, book. look at a book first. <laughs> what happened? Uh, read the book or don't read the book. Oh. <laughs> Tim, you have made a terrible error. <laughs> oh, no. Not read the goddamn book. Oh, this no. This will affect your of destiny. Of course. Kind I of figured. encyclopedia of monstrous and unknown creatures. I'm beginning to, get, begin, <laughs> beginning to believe they exist. <laughs> She's like, what? What'd you just do? Nothing. Did you hear that? Did you just, did you just read that? That's yeah. twice you've stepped on my toes, detective. Try not to make a habit. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I cock block you? Or I'm sorry, uh, twat swat you then? What have you come looking for in this gallery? Well, I asked about the painting. Uh, I'm not here to create problems for you. Uh, I've got to verify the painting. <laughs> the painting's for a buyer. That's a stupid. Another painting by Sarah Hawkins. It's not your goddamn business, bitch. I'm not here to cause trouble, if that's what's worrying you. Worry me? Don't overestimate yourself. Uh. If the last beating wasn't enough for you, I can always give it another go. But as long as you keep out I'm of my way, fine with that. You don't got your goons. <laughs> and, uh, I and think you? there's a comfortable what are couch you doing somewhere. here are very well. And you? What brings you to the Sanders home? I want to continue to be antagonistic. I business. Irene asked me to liquidate all these paintings. Yep. She doesn't intend to hang around here for long. Why you? Believe it or not. Because I can peddle them. Darkwater. <laughs> yeah. Someone with a network and a means of transport to the mainland. A choice that comes down to Fitzroy and me. And I'm far more pleasant. Wouldn't you say? Now we need Not like the way that. you hunched and walked away. <laughs> Jesus. All right. Well, can you talk go. to you again? Not now, sweetheart. I'd oh. Like to read this without some snoop looking over my shoulder. Oh, you said sweetheart. <gasps> oh, touch. I'm going to find you a ring. <laughs> <laughs> we going to be married. We going to have one of those begrudging weddings, but I'm we going to get it. We going to have some of that angry sex. Some of that hate fucking. It's going to be good. You can keep Busting my balls. Hmm. That's it. Yep. I clicked a button for him to say, hmm. hmm. He could have done that <laughs> automatically. 
I gained nothing. These artifacts date from pre-Columbian times. How do you know? Did I, did I pass like a wisdom check on that? <laughs> A history, a history check? check? Like what? Nat 20 on a history check? These artifacts date it's from nothing. Times. It's, it's nothing to tell me that. Maybe it was just a shit dude locally who made that. You don't know. <laughs> I mean, good lord. Oh, oh land yeah, trial. Yeah. Uh, oh. I don't like the fact that there's so many places to hide in here. Ooh. Who the hell Wait, are you? Yeah, one eye. Chopped out. That's weird. Why was he so interested in old weapons? Uh, sacrificial tools. Uh, I mean, there's some. They're old. Mm. Oh. oh, what the? F Ancient tablets in stone. Yeah. You don't want to excavate it or anything. I'm pretty sure the stone is worth nothing. The tablets themselves, I feel like, are the important bits. And yep. you've got a lot of them. So, Maybe that's why he's like, yeah, I'll keep these ones on the stone. It's more, uh, more uh, It's the vogue. same thing. It's a copy. Yeah. Ugh. Yeah. Oh, I pulled a common. <laughs> I would absolutely love it if some of these... Nope, not going there yet. <laughs> I would absolutely love it if some of these statues like looked at me. Oh, that'd be cool. Uh, ugh. Ugh. Oh. Ugh. That is a... Nasty. That is a weird one. And in uh, in the red corner, okay. we have a Ooh. human muscular statue. Speed this along. Yep. More paintings. Nothing. More paintings. Oh, is this back to the same room? Oh, I think. No. Yeah, this was the first These room. Artifacts yeah, it's the same room. Pre-Columbian times. Yep. <sighs> All right. Well, uh, I mean, you can either try to go through that door. I don't know what was in here, but you know. The public it, entrance to the gallery. Uh, oh, this is public. Ugh. I mean, the size of it, I would imagine that it would be. Yeah. Ugh. All right. Well. Oh. Is this dagger part of Sanders' collection? Oh, I mean, like we've seen that dagger before, right? Yes, we have. Does this give me the ability to kill it? <laughs> oh. Oh, more lamp oil. Why two places I mean, in here? Yeah. That's odd. If I look at the painting, there's all of a sudden like, then now I gotta Lights hide. Go out. Yeah, and I gotta I run. Mean, obviously. All right, bitch. Oh boy. Show yourself, you bitch. I mean, it's not even. It's not even a finished painting. Yep. Yeah. Nice. Well, your hair certainly got shaggy all of a sudden. Yeah, I just immediately started sweating. Oh my god, why? That's what it looks like? Oh, does it have like two extra arms on its back? I think they're wings. Antennas? I mean, just choke slam the bitch. Look at the neck. The easy target. <laughs> that, that literally. Oh come on. All right. What the hell was that? Where the hell is that? I mean, somewhere in that general area. Oh. I don't think you're supposed to look at it. I'm not trying to. Is it drawing your? No, I like I I just don't know I don't know where it is. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. I don't know where it's going. I mean, let's use audio clues. It's to your right right now, on the other side of the room. Hide in the closet. Press A. Nah, I'm good. Let's just leave. 
Probably can't go through this door. What the hell? I can't even touch it. Why? Absolutely, it's gonna kill me. Why was I still talking? <laughs> I died. Uh, Am I, mean, I gonna get out the main entrance? No, you have to get rid of the uh, the shambler. Well, how? Burn the painting. Oh. Hold B. Okay, there we go. There you go. All right. Burn the painting. What was that? Oh, there you go. You can look at the painting from the front. The thing came out of this painting. There has to be a link. Maybe if I destroy it. <laughs> I mean. All right, no. I, to... I think there is one of the knives that you need to grab to use to destroy the chandelier. Oh. And that's why there were so many knives all over the place. And there's a oh knife my on the God. floor. A picture of a knife on the floor. Yep. Telling you which one you need. What the hell was that? Oh my God. <sighs> it wasn't in here, it was the one across the room. Probably. Down. Maybe. This dagger. I don't think that was the right one. It's not. Where is it? It's right there. Where is its pattern? I don't know why you're hiding here and not inside the closet. Why would I want to be inside the closet? I mean, I get basically the exact same freak out effect. Except for the fact that when you freak out, you, you know, doesn't immediately kill you. Nope, wrong one. Is it here? It, it can hear? Yes! Yeah. Ow! You were trying to stab it? Yes, I was trying to stab it! You can't stab it! It's a shambler! You can't stab a shambler! You stupid or something? What kind of stupid cock are you? God. What the hell was that? Oh my god. It can see! Yes! What? It has no eyes! That doesn't matter! It's a horror from the abyss! It can hear, see, smell, taste, and do whatever the fuck it wants! There we go. Now just freak out in here for a while. I don't know if this kills me. I probably will eventually. Is... Alright, you can probably exit now. Is that... so which knife was it? Uh, it's the one that is two um, branches going around each other. Don't smash it open yet. That not one. that one. No, nope. it's not that one? Not that one. I think it's in the middle room. It's not that one either. Not the, not the like the large room. It's. It might have been that one, but I don't think so. This one? No, no, no. The one on the right, over there. But I don't think it is. Do you think there's only one knife? Yeah. It's very specific about. Right, he's over on the very far end. Just sneak on over. All right, so. Uh, is it? Nope. nope. Is it? Is that one? Uh, no. Uh, nope. Yes. Down. This dagger looks different. Stab the painting, stab the painting, <laughs> stab the painting. <laughs> there we go. Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's right, bitch! Stab the painting again! Keep stabbing it! Fuck the painting up! Stab him! I 
I mean, you just made it your bitch. Why are you so scared? <laughs> what? Uh. What's the matter with you? <laughs> Achievement? Yes. You sure you won't be needing that hand? You're losing it, detective. At this rate, you're right. The bottle will get you before I do. Did I say that? I mean... I didn't see anything. I saw you within an inch of putting a dagger through your forearm. Yes, but this is a long hallway to get to that point. Did you see nothing? The painting was cursed. Uh, I was attacked by a creature. No, I just drank a bit too much. I mean, I really want to be honest. It, but it's one of those being honest saves gives me nothing. I, sure. But at least you're professional in your occultism now. Sanders was right. This painting is cursed. What are you talking about? I was attacked by a creature. I pushed it back, I think. I... I think so, too. What? What? You knew? About the monster? You didn't hear anything? You must have noticed the statue... Or the state of my arm. Or, I mean, you knew about the monster. That's more of an interesting... You, you knew. You knew about the beast. What are you talking about? What? Think yourself lucky that I saved your hand. Even if it was to save my goods. I'm, you mean me. Don't flatter yourself, you, sweetheart. I'm so I'm confused. The contents of this gallery. I don't want blood way, all over him. Where do you think you're going with that dagger? It saved my life. It's an extraordinary dagger. You should talk to Algernon Drake. He's an antique dealer here on Darkwater. He'll tell okay. you all about it. From what I saw in the ledgers, it was him who sold it to Sanders. Cool. Was that after you bought the, the Shambler? Oh, you should talk to him, and you give me this information for uh, free of charge? Question mark? It's yeah. It's not your style to give me free information like Without that. Without a nut Take blast. Take for being my canary. A simple trade-off. Now go see your antique seller. I still got things to say. Didn't she say that she knew she thinks so too yeah. about the creature? That it's cursed or whatever? Yeah, like she said something along those lines. What? What happened? I mean, it wasn't it was empty you. box. Uh, it, that wasn't you. That was someone else. The key? I mean, no, you got the key off the... What, what was the key for? That room, the gallery. But it's a room that I have to go into. Yeah. So what was the point in like me having like a strength check? If oh. I fail it, does she just open it for me? I don't know. Maybe you would have owned... Uh, owned uh, some of these are false... Maybe you would have owed Cat more. I don't know. Some of these are like false achievements oh. or false hey. um, choices. It's blood. You Why know, is there blood? Things that you don't like. Yeah, sure, it happens, regardless. But then why? Why even give you like even the whole like the uh, the painting is cursed. The 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 occult choice. Literally one statement later, and he's talking about the beast, which Where I'm pretty sure. Mother? Why does everyone know this Reverend's wife? <laughs> you know why. You don't want to read that? Fine. Is it just the same stuff? The pastor declared the himself stuff. to be the prophet. He renounced God and worshipped a strange pagan entity with a monstrous appearance. That escalated quickly. His wife tried to reason with her husband, but in the but in vain. Uh, he was convinced that he must listen to this voice in his head because it holds the truth. Literally a statement later, or literally a statement earlier, people were talk it, it was talking about, like, oh, people are having weird dreams. And all of a sudden he's like, there is no God! There is but one God, and its name is... History of Darkwater. A uh, Puritan colony, blah, blah, blah. Uh, they erected the first buildings among which were uh, were the Hawkins Manor, the church, and the cemetery. Okay, why would a manor be your first building? Um, I don't know. I think a port would be the first yeah. one. Yeah. 
Uh, the rare village huts would documents be. and uh, handwritten notes they left speak of nightmares <clears throat> and deviant behaviors. Unless it was a rich family that bought the island. I mean, yeah, for I like guess. independence, that would make sense. But wait, what's it? there? It is. You did it. Oh no! Just green gooey light everywhere. Oh yeah, I gotta love that green gooey light. Okay, I don't think there's anything else. All right, and here. Give me some knowledge. Knowledge. Here we go. All right, dark. Uh, <laughs> dark. <laughs> volume two. Dark water. Volume, no, volume four. four. Yeah. Uh, after months of pursuit, uh, Skyla returns to the port with a gigantic creature on board. Yeah, we already know about that story. After a night of ferocious combat, the survivors... Wait. Its crew ass asserts that the sea monster had eaten all the, uh, all the disappeared whales. After a night of ferocious combat, the survivors managed to drag the beast onto the whaling ship. Okay. Was that the miraculous catch? Yeah. Okay. That's what I thought. And I mean, if it were a colossal, you know, squid, they do eat. Or, I mean, no, they don't eat whales, but. They're, they're more like mutual predators. Like, they, they both attack the same stuff. If they're in each other's. They're territorial. Yeah. If but they're in they each don't other's like hunt each path, other. Uh, the, the whale will try to eat the, the squid. Because, you know, it is a, a very large food source. Yeah. Um, only certain kind of whales. Um, you know, but the squid w will and can okay. fight back. I don't want to do that yet. Well. Well, uh, it's too late. It's too late. Sucks your, your, eyes are, your eyes are cloudy now. Zion is the foundational work behind Helena Blavatsky's theosophical movement. Its followers place truth on the same footing as a religion. Interesting. It sounds like it was a religion. Oh, nice. Cultism. More occultism. Cool. You know, I'm starting to wonder, what if you didn't get any points in occultism and you end up just being like rationalizing everything and be like, no, this should, no. <laughs> Would the monster not even attack you? It's just yeah. like some scary weird guy. Some hobo just came busting in. Handbook on anatomy, anatomy and, and dissection. More medicine. medical. Yeah, baby. Oh. What's this? Would you... <laughs> Would you like to read the book? We're going to read all the books. We're going to read all the books. What does this strange book contain? This book contains unholy Oh, hey, look. It's what does this book. strange book contain? This book contains... <laughs> <laughs> Malice bestial. <laughs> it's, like, it's like, ooh, this is interesting. This was a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> like, immediately opens it. I have made a terrible uh, Like, you'd think that reading those books would give me the, the, the ability to fight them. I mean, you know, sure. Rather than horrify me, I I, I don't like how my yeah, vision like, is still. It's like reading creepypasta, Tim. Yeah, but it makes you stronger. Because <laughs> now you know how to how to fight, you know, um, and deal with, you know, certain people. Sonics dot <laughs> son Sonic dot exe. Yeah. 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 Exactly. Handbook on anatomy and dissection, book one. More book medicine. one. Have they all been book one? Strange I think amulet. so. I have a feeling I'd better not touch it. <laughs> As he's holding it. You just did. You, I took it. <laughs> I better not touch it. I have it now. It this is guy's mine. an idiot. <laughs> was, was there an option to not? No. Oh, God. Oh, my God. All right. Well, I am 100% fucking myself over with the... Oh. There are dead rats there. Oh, it won't let me until I do all this. Yeah, shit. naturally. Let's start over. Where did they break in from? Uh, the door. <laughs> Blood. Very good. Like amateur work. I mean, if they got blood all over it, yeah. All right, and then from also, here. Also, it's a freaking wood door. Uh, I mean, there's blood right there what behind steps? you. I mean, oh wait, yeah, yeah, go back. Look at that. Okay, never mind. It doesn't do anything. But there is one over there. To the left. There's a bone. To that. To whom does this footprint belong? They're uh, leaving? Yeah. I'm going to assume that they were attacked up there. 
So they came back here, they fought, and then... And then he ran to the back abandoned. room to get his safe. What is that book card for? This burglar seems to be rather clumsy. Ah, he's it's not a burglar, shit. I don't think. He's kind of shit at his job. What killed all these animals? What sort of thief leaves his tools at the crime scene? Uh, he's not a professional what thief. The burglar flee before finishing his work. I mean, protective symbol. Yeah. Oh, holy fuck! What? Okay. <clears throat> so the person that, whoa, is glitches. What's happening? What the? Charles What's happening? Hawkins? He got yeeted backwards by the protective ward. Wow. What's happening to Hawkins? I mean, he's becoming one with the god he wished to worship. What sort of power did Sarah Hawkins' painting possess? Oh, my, she did that. Yeah. It, the Necronomicon. I mean, Sarah it's gotta be. Hide something in the safe. Uh huh. I and would love for her head to just turn around and look at me, and give me a message. Oh. Drake put in a great deal of effort to hide. Everything is linked to the Sarah Hawkins case. Uh, yeah. She has quite astounding abilities. All right. Wow. Now, now I'm going to open this. And uh, oh. what link did he find between Charles Hawkins and an old and this key that bears the elder sign is the only one able to protect you. What? Just magic paint. I mean, maybe. Is it paint made out of the that glowing liquid? Maybe. It is in the form of a crystal, or sorry, cylindrical med medallion. That's not cylindrical. That's that's a circle. <laughs> and then we flattened it down. Oh, okay. Oh, right, now makes sense. Hanging at the end of a heavy chain. Yeah, that's a circle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you idiot. Uh, hundreds of years ago, the star and the branch whose purpose uh, is to push back the forces of the Great Old Ones were engraved at its center. Everything points to it being Charles Hawkins that tore it from, the, uh, from its last owner, an Egyptian antique dealer. In, uh, in press cuttings that mention <clears throat> the m misdemeanor? Wait a minute. Oh. What? Okay. Uh, the misdemeanor, the date of the robbery, uh, coincides with the last of Hawkins' trips to the uh, to Cairo. It remains to be seen whether he knows of the true purpose of the artifact. Try <laughs> to find it. All right, cool. Is everyone on this island taking sleeping pills? Oh, thank God. More sleeping pills. Oh, yes, please. Wait, did I take them? They're still there. <laughs> oh. It says item obtained. I'm looking right at it. <laughs> I know, it says item obtained. That's weird. All right. Drake left instructions on how to find the combination of his safe. Whoa. Why? Just in case he died? All right. Uh, oh, no. Following message is of capital importance. Uh... Um, unless you only hope it's another day, everybody, everybody and bones are still in, whoa, there's some bones lying around, is that, is that what he's saying? Possibly. Uh, the following message, uh, whoever reads, there's a lot of, uh, uh, Greek word. World. Greek world. Where life and study combine in the Greek world. Um, the theater. Okay, okay, so he's listing the books that we gotta find. Yeah. Okay, so there's some books we gotta find first, and then that'll tell us in the order. That's what I'm gathering. Sure. Sounds about right. Uh, I'm gonna assume it's back in the other room. 
Jeez. That doesn't sound good. She is one powerful woman. Is she actually dead? Nah. Whoa! All right, well. <laughs> looks like. <laughs> I wasn't expecting <laughs> the church. Conditions. Never heard of them. Uh, nightmare lyrics uh, collection. Of, uh, oh, the numbers on. Yeah, on, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. Uh, uh, let's go. Okay. Let's go back to the. Nope. What was it? Clue? Is it clue? No, it wouldn't be clue. No. Um, it would be inventory. And then the, there you go. Drake's uh, memoirs. Okay. Each cylinder is uh, numbered, uh, even if, as the uh, celebrated author says, uh, order is the pleasure of reason, but disorder is the delight of the imagination. Indeed, despite their uh, preference for organized chaos, I must admit that reason usually prevails in the end. If by chance a person, or should I say a genius, was to match my intelligence <laughs> and find the core <laughs> combination of the safe, I would ask that they deliver the contents. I'm just gonna jack myself off real quick. I think I've earned that. <laughs> scroll oh, down. Champagne of victory. <laughs> scroll down. Uh, into the safekeeping <clears throat> of my friend and colleague, Professor um, Armitage. Armita you know, Armita uh -huh. Of um, Miskatonic University. Oh yeah, that's an actual character. That's a reoccurring character. Yeah. Uh, in, the in contents of this safe is character. not only a uh, vast digest of knowledge, but also a weapon that is far too dangerous for it to fall into the wrong hands. I hope that you will be able to um, appreciate the danger that this uh, uh, represents, and that you will act accordingly in any event. I will neither be here to judge or to guide, <laughs> to judge you, uh, nor judging, to suffer judging, from judging. your actions. All right, scroll back up. It looks like it's actually all the way in the top. Um, hidden here. All right. Uh, if somebody finds these memoirs, there will be no <sighs> doubt that I am in serious trouble. My last and only hope is that the uh, body and bones are still in place of reality and order that they be recovered and burned. The funeral urn must be given to my dear mother if she is to still uh, if she is still of this world. Oh, okay, so he was he was just saying in poetic terms yeah. help my body uh, The following that. message is of capital importance. Whoever reads these lines and uh, demonstrates acuity as sharp as mine gain access to my most precious possession it lies within my safe and the clues to the combination are to be found in the in the, in three cylinders each hidden where life and study combines in the greek world oh okay so you need to find the cylinders first how many volumes are there in this collection no Another no, no, no. those are those are the books that we'll need but uh oh, the cylinders aren't in the books no oh why would the cylinders not be in the books? Because he needs to spread out all the clues more. No, but I mean, like, you could have, like, some books cut open and there's, like, a cylinder inside. And damage the books? Well, I mean, you could have multiple copies. That's... It could be Moby Dick. I'm sure there's tons of copies of Moby Dick around here. Still destroying the books. Oh, wait. The cup? Is that... A kind of chalice. Huh. I mean... We didn't see that before. We weren't able to click on it before. A kind of chalice. Is there literally nothing to this? Huh. That's... <sighs> oh, chessboard? Things are not looking good. Okay! All right, so what? interact I... with the, 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 the phonograph. I can't. Oh. No option. I really wish I could. Oh, wait, did that... Oh, that's oil. There's a cylinder. No. It's a cylinder. Uh, it's a cylinder, yes. Those, Those are, cylinders. are cylinders. Yep, I know. Oh, oh, they mean one of these kinds of cylinders. The idiots. I thought it's bones. Those aren't his bones. Those are just bones. You don't know that. Freud's The Interpretation of Dreams. It's the work that laid the foundations of psychoanalysis at the beginning of this century. And was... Was mostly false. Mostly false, yeah. Mostly self... Basically... Uh, indulgent. Yeah, it was, a lot of it was trying to... Uh, basically him trying to say, 
I'm not crazy. I'm it not is natural. One. It's I'm not natural. It's natural this way. It's natural. It's very natural. Oh, man. None of these were accessible before. No, they were. We just overlooked them. There's so many books. Do you think it's easier to find With stuff in the lantern? Possibly. Hmm. There's nothing there. To the right. Arkham editions. Never heard of them. There we go. Those are your cylinders. Cylinders that Drake tried to hide. I should perhaps listen to them. Didn't do an amazing job. Trying to hide. All right, now go to the phonograph. Okay. Make sure there's nothing else. I'm gonna get some creepy ass messages. So we s just screaming. <laughs> just nine minutes of screaming on one of them. All um, right. Oh. Wait, don't I have one from... Um, you did, but we never played it. And, um... I don't know if I can anymore. I don't think you can. Was there... There might have been one in... In one of the other rooms? Yeah. That I never went to. And these red rocks, like precious stones, lie fixed, set in divine gold. To be the guardian of the grail does not protect me from... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. And I do confess it. I am willing to pay to know its secrets. Okay. I finally understood that we were only pieces on the chessboard of the gods. Okay. Let those of us who are still standing protect our white queen from their dark soldiers. Okay. I see our number dwindling, and my will strengthens as my apprehension grows. Okay. We shall refuse to be the playthings of destiny. Dear friend, I thank you again for the anthology of the works of Arkham editions that you sent me. Okay. Will you nine? Azathoth and other horrors seemed particularly relevant to my research. Uh -huh. I never tire of browsing through them. All right, so I feel like that one just told us number nine. Yeah, I think nine. it just told us nine. All right. So count the number of... Um, on the cup. Yeah. Oh, neat. All right, so there's okay. one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, five. Five. Five... Three nine. It's not four. It's three because they're the ones that are protecting the, the okay. queen. And the one piece off the board you I, don't think counts? No. Okay. Because it's not on the board protecting the queen. So. Question is, do you think he leaves that chessboard up all the time? They're glued there. Okay. So three four nine. No. What? what <laughs> five, three, nine. Five, three, nine. <laughs> what? <laughs> All right. Uh, the triggers to change the lock and the right thumbstick to rotate. Five. Oh, oh. Yeah. I thought I was having to actually turn the no. thumbstick. Five, right trigger. Three, right trigger. And nine. There that we go. was it? Well, yeah, he just said the number. Yeah, he's just like, and eh, number nine. It was, and uh, and uh, the number nine was really good <laughs> as far as all the articles I liked. Why did we even have all of the other like books there to look at for the anthology? I don't know. I guess that they just did that as like a as like a um, a. Um, Are we playing it on easy mode? No, probably probably all those other books was um, as a distraction. I mean, maybe, yeah. So if someone, like, didn't get all the information... Well, this was a mistake. Absolutely. <clears throat> Something about that hand. They really they like really that, like that hand. hand. That left hand. That J.O. hand. Oh, man. Whoa. I mean, it doesn't have the ring on it. So, you know. It's like, oh, so you're single. Um... Of all the other people having dreams. I'm going back to the insane asylum. Uh, Riverside Institute. Maybe. Did I not leave? I don't know. Maybe. Dude, if I find out that I didn't leave, and those are the dreams that they're all talking about, I'm gonna lose my shit. <laughs> or did you leave? But then they tell you didn't. You didn't leave. What is real? What is fake? If I actually left and they said I didn't leave? Yeah, if you if you left. Uh-huh. And you wind up up back there. And then they tell me, no, they, you've been here this whole time, and this is the dream? Yeah. Oh, okay. 
I thought you were saying like when I was back at the manor and those two were like, they're like, no, you're still there. No, you're still. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck are you talking about? Dr. Colvin, this man's condition is deteriorating. Exactly. It's Dr. Fuller. It's his patient after all. Oh, he, am I her? He's busy oh. with Captain Fitzroy. Huh. He specifically. <laughs> the first thing I do is I like start just falling. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I've always wondered what this was like. I, I wonder what it felt like. Is that me? Yeah. I'm Dr. Colden. We'll take care of you. There's nothing Wait, we can do. I don't think that. I tried talking to him. He's catatonic. Oh no! He's cat Examine You tried talking to him, so there's nothing we can do. <laughs> examine the patient. Very well. I'll examine him. Cause you're stupid! You stupid bitch! Thirty year old subject. Severe hypothermia. Erythematous papules around the eyes and eardrums. Necros palupal tissue. Lord, this smell. Uh, yeah, right, you I'll, didn't check nothing. I'll Don't look at me with that. your squinty eyes. I'll take that. your word for that. His skin shows abnormal loss of color and seems dried out. He's totally dehydrated. His fingertips and toes seem to feature a slight ring under the skin, tender at the touch, slightly sticky. Okay. Severe malnutrition. Swollen abdomen with traces of petechia. Oh, I really wish I knew, like knew what a lot of these terms were. <laughs> to the Some of them I'm picking up, but like yeah. the specific, like the underneath the eyes, I was like, so, doctor, never heard that word. Opinion? I'm not sure I have the necessary knowledge. Uh, yeah. Give him water. You're our most worthy doctor after Dr. Fuller. Then why did you doubt me after? Oh, I've already looked at him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna try talking to him. I can't do nothing. Did you find? That you're an idiot. Uh, he has something in his belly. The state of his limb, uh, limbs is uh, worrisome. Uh, he's severely dehydrated. I mean, all of these are true. <laughs> I mean, what do you want to go with first? I see signs of hypodermoclysis. The first thing is he needs to be hydrated. Yeah. He needs fluids. Last IV. He's constantly under perfusion. I've even gone beyond the recommended dose to no avail. And you won't believe me, but when we bathed him earlier, he seemed to feel better? Yes. Like he needs an aquarium, not a perfusion. But that doesn't explain his condition. Uh, he's a sailor. I guess I'm you examine his okay. abdomen. It would seem there's something inside. He hasn't eaten in days. Are you certain it's not an edema? No. Can't you recognize an edema? Pushing with your finger won't leave a trace. And look at these bumps. They're actually going through a lot of detail on this. Yeah. Pregnant. Whatever it is. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> That'd be weird. <laughs> I mean, okay. You guys Dr. understand parasites, before. right? Like, right? You guys. Right. If he had like a yeah. huge parasite in his stomach, sure then that would mean no matter what he ate or drank, it would be consuming all yeah. of that. Yeah. You. You're in stupid. You're literally right by the ocean. There's a horrible forest behind you. It could be all kinds of awful things. If there is a bone in this arm, it's softer than that of a newborn baby. What about his cranium? It's soft at the touch. It does seem like the skull of a baby. Look at the Ugh. <laughs> growing at his fingertips. What oh, he's changing to a squid. I'm sure That's what it sounds like. Explanation. You have to. Why are you flickering? His body is mutating. I almost don't believe it myself, but these symptoms are not those usually associated with the human species. What do you mean? Don't tell me you believe in extraterrestrials. No. That's not what I said. Man is from but okay. But his body is undergoing unnatural mutations. And this I mean, there's. I wouldn't say any mutation is natural. His body simply can't cope. <laughs> Where could he have gotten such an infection? I pray that it's not here. Dr. Colden, may I know what you're doing to my patient? Uh, what looking at him. How about what you've done to him? Let us calm down, my dear Marie. I don't appreciate your tone, nor your insinuations. I've done to him what I do to all my patients. Provide him with the best available care. 
including the insectoid. It's your homemade drug again, is it not? Those people are not your guinea pigs. There, there. It's fine. The FDA doesn't exist out here. Um, these symptoms are worry uh, are worrisome. Uh, I've never seen anything like this. You're turning him into a monster. Let's not go accusatory. Um, let's just these are alarming symptoms. Let's just keep it natural. We don't act. He'll die. Do you believe? Don't want like don't want this guy to know that we're on to him. <laughs> I even think this man has a strong chance of completely healing from his ailments. No, doctor. This patient isn't himself anymore. He's dying. Really? That will completely <laughs> cure him. <laughs> Death is the ultimate cure for all diseases. He will no longer be, be suffering from nail biting and insomnia. <laughs> <laughs> because he won't have any nails or the need to sleep. Cephalopod, perhaps. This amuses you. Oh, yes. Yes, yes. of course. Knowledge, doctor. It's your innocent worries for this man that have you overreacting. <laughs> this man and the others whose medical files you've been hiding. Yeah. I have to protect my discovery. These people owe me their life, but the world isn't ready yet. It will be. They owe you their life for what? Maybe he's not the one that's actually mutating them. But, I still but hope you think he's an idiot? No, that he's meantime, wanting to <coughs> research their transformation. Oh, okay. Either that, or he's trying to turn them back into cephalopods from from human. Oh, yeah. It was a warning. Doctor Fuller is this institution's founder and one of our profession's most influential voices. My word is of no weight against his. He's violent. If I continue to protect He will shank me. I will only ruin my reputation and career. It's scandalous. Can't we do anything? Is there no evidence of his crimes? No. This guy. I mean, nobody mentioned crimes for now. Uh, Hidden yeah. files are proof. Nobody mentioned crimes for now. Uh, say out of this. Hmm. I mean, technically, hidden files are proof. I mean, if he's hiding yes. information from the medical community, then he's hiding the information from the rest of the hospital staff, the, the rest of the hospital staff, which should be yeah. assisting in the curing and treatment oh, of the individuals. Oh, yeah. I'm sure of it. I need to find the missing medical files. And where you would you find those? In his office. What if you get caught? I'd rather not think about that. I'm counting on your discretion. Of course, Doctor. You can count on me. I'll keep Mum. I'll keep Mum. So, was she originally supposed to have, like, a Cockney accent, and they just didn't bother till now? An unknown medicine. All right. Judging by the other ones, it causes heavy side effects. Like, extra sleep. He's in that extra heavy sleep. Extra sleep, dehydration, parasites in the belly, and transformation into a cephalopod. It's all normal! 100% natural ingredients. This is this is his medicine, isn't it? <laughs> He's really trying to peddle this. All right. Um, so, anyway, um, that's going to be it for this episode. Um, things are starting to get interesting. Uh, finally fought something, kind of. I mean, you I, I died fought a, a painting. I fought a pa I did combat with a painting. <laughs> I'm trying to think of some sort of pun on Mortal Kombat, but I couldn't come uh, up with anything. I don't know. Uh, but it, I would love, like, Bo Bob Ross. <laughs> just get Beat the devil out of <laughs> It just, like, slaps it across the room, like, paints over it, like, puts a nice, <laughs> a, a nice thin thin layer of, of uh, what was it, uh, uh, liquid white just <laughs> right over. Put a little phthalo blue and see it just starts to <laughs> change. <laughs> like, behind him, just mutated. <laughs> <laughs> a little happy little cloud right there. <laughs> just like and just, just a tree right in the <laughs> <Just> <laughs> beat the devil out. I of love it. that. Side note, um one of his students, um, who's probably like um his the guy who like runs like a school of teaching people how to paint like Bob Ross, he has his own channel and he and he paints like Bob Ross. He's like trying to keep that going. 
And he's doing a good job. I actually like his paintings. Well, I remember that. They look a little too much like Bob Ross, but that's because Bob Ross did Everything. one thing. It was always it didn't it, it, like it was always trees. It was always mountains. It was always rivers. It was always the sky. It was just a different time of day, different mountain. Like just move it around. Yeah, but yeah. it was like those those things over and over and over again. Never drew people. Never did people. But nah. Anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Totally fine. Subscribe if you're new. Bell for notifications and leave down in the comment section below. Like to see us play any other games. Uh, again, this is Occult Tober month, so we're doing a whole bunch of. Occult games, H.P. Lovecraft style themed stuff, things, and uh, until next time, peace!